What's up, YouTube? Moto Mike 805 here. Today we are going to get the GoPro 8 out, and hopefully this one works. Um, my GoPro 7. Um, I'm thinking that the something up with the audio died in it, allowing it to um, the uh, what do you call it? Here we go. The external adapter, I don't think, it, from what I've researched and troubleshot, this typically isn't the problem when your external mic stops working. Uh, it's usually the GoPro itself. So, going off hours of research, I decided to order the 8. Here's the 7, which I think something's up. We ordered the 8, and then also had to get a new frame. It can hold the mic adapter down there, kind of like the other one I had on the old helmet. This is the one, I mean, not the old helmet, my helmet I used, the old frame. So this was the uh, the one I used for the 7 that had the uh, holder there that you could put the external mic adapter in and it held it in the frame, nice and neat underneath the camera. So we're going to open this up here just showed up today only took two days to get here from Amazon so here we go I guess I didn't really need to undo that. Well, we'll in a bit. Let's see here. How does this come out of this frame? Is this a frame? I think it's a frame. Oh, okay, I see. These things, the down here, they just collapse in. <clears throat> Where does the battery go? Maybe I should uh, read some destructions before I start destructing it. moving down here. Oh, okay. Ah, I guess that's where the battery goes. And, hmm. I think there might be something else we might need to get for this, because... That looks right there. That looks like where we need to plug in the mic adapter. So, is there a special door we have to buy? I guess I should have researched this some more because it's looking like there's probably a special door. So, of course, something extra to purchase. So, this will be a very short video, but hey. Let's get the battery out. Let's just see at least if it works. So it is a different battery. The batteries are backwards compatible with the old sevens but it says that you need the one with the blue tip here to use all the features on the eight i'm not sure exactly what all those features are but let's pop this in here and i probably need to peel this off so we can see the screen Power, power it on. Oh, my phone's not kind of 
easy. If I could barely touch it. GoPro. We want English. Check. Sure, I agree. Uh, GPS, I guess on. I don't think I ever used that with the old one. Install the GoPro app on your phone. Leave your camera on and allow instructions. Okay, so why we, uh, that's up there. Let's go to the phone here. Find the GoPro app. That should be right here somewhere. There it is, GoPro. Okay, camera. Connect to your GoPro. Oh, I see. Add. Hero 8 Connect. There we go. So it found it. Pairing. We found your GoPro. Change camera name. I don't know. Um, let's see here. How about GoPro 8? There, good camera name. Done. What do we do now? Save new name. 8 to uh, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, oh, it's not long enough. Maybe it's that hero in there. Hero and done. There we go. Save new name. You can't rename your GoPro. Something went wrong. Oh, this says it died. <laughs> Let's see. Try again. Is it, oh yeah, it's got zero battery. You know what? Let's do this. So, batteries come with zero charge, it looks like. So we're gonna take this one out. And we'll take the one from the seven, since we're not actually recording video right now. Should I put the seven battery in there so we can set it up? Oh, the tabs go different ways. I don't know if you can see that. The tab on the old one is going towards the door. The tab on the new one is going away from the door. The tab that you pull it out with. Okay, so, fire it back up. Battery notice. Yeah, yeah, it's not the right battery. We know. So it'll still work for what we're doing. So, update camera. Update. Couldn't connect. Okay. Uh, cancel, cancel, cancel. Let's see, let's try this again. Let's go. Let's get solution. Now, it's just, it didn't connect because it was dead. <laughs> Control. Here we go, let's reconnect. Okay, camera update is available. Update camera. Update camera, there we go. Connect. <clears throat> Connection successful. Sure, I accept. Battery level device. Micro SD card. Oh, there's no card in it. We should probably put an SD card in there. Mm -hmm. here. Hang on here. back and do that in a second. So let's hit uh, cancel. Cancel. Let's turn this off. We'll put an SD card in. Oh, I need it. Battery on. 
Let's see, slide the SD card in. Put the battery back in. Turn it back on. Yes, it's fine. Okay, connect to your GoPro. Third time's a charm. Update camera. See if it works this time. Well, that's updating. Let's check this out. So, this was the new frame I got for the 8. Oh, look at that. I don't think I need to buy a new door. I think this may replace it. I think we can take the door off of the the 8, slide it in the frame, and look at this door has a little hole there. So maybe we won't need to buy a special door. I'm not positive on that, but I can dream, right? Uh, we're going to have to figure out how to use, how to open this thing here. Oh, push. It says forward, forward, open. I don't know. We'll figure it out in a minute. Okay. Installing update. All right. I guess let's mess with this some more. So it's got a little arrow right here. And it looks like it says push forward. So, but nothing's happening. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, there we go. See, it opens up. Oh, look at that. I don't think we need anything special. I think this right here holds the battery in. So I think this closes. This holds the battery in. We just have to remove the door, that open door right there off of the eight. I think we will be good to go. And then this has the hole there so we can plug in. It's kind of hard to see. There we go. That hole right. Sorry, I'm like doing this backwards. It's like I'm doing it in a mirror. Right there. Our mic adapter can go in that hole when we close the door. And the kit, the, the one I bought is the Artman Extra Power for you. Um, V-Log case for GoPro 8. It was like $15.99 on eBay, it was like 16, 17 bucks with ta with tax. Um, so, V-logging case for your GoPro 8. Good, good investment there. All right, uh, installing update. Please toggle off and on your wait. Please toggle off and on your phone's Wi-Fi. Your GoPro will power off and on a few times when the update is complete. Your camera screen will return to normal. Okay. Let's see, please toggle on and off your phone's Wi-Fi. So I guess it wants me to do this. Ah, come on phone. Off. On. Is that what they want me to do? Okay. Got it. Control your GoPro. Maybe we should, let's see, let's set the camera up here so we can actually enable preview. Uh, we'll connect your GoPro Wi-Fi enable, oh, you got it. <clears throat> hey, see, there it is. Hey, YouTube. <laughs> Looks like it's working through the cell phone there. All right, so now what we got to do is find out if um, my mic adapter works. 
new custom presets standard activity I don't know if you can Ooh. see this it's kind of hard on this I'm trying to on the old camera you had to enable protune I don't see that on there um, preferences here's input okay so it's audio and a so let's go ahead and I guess let's power this off and we'll plug in the adapter and see what happens okay so we're going to plug in the audio adapter and then get the helmet up here because the mic is inside the helmet plug in a little pigtail here Adapter. Okay, so I'll power it back on, and when we go in there now, it should show options under input for audio. See, standard mic, audio. Got standard, power, power mic, power mic plus, line in. Uh, I guess we'll just leave it on standard mic, but it's, I don't know if you could see a little bit ago, it said NA, and that's what was happening on this one. No matter what I did, it said NA. It was not showing that the external mic was plugged in. So now, it's showing that there is an external mic plugged in, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and I'll throw my helmet on here and blow a little air in the microphone and try to see if we can figure out if it's working. Hopefully it is. Then I'll have to go plug it into the Computer, download it and test it. Well, actually, maybe we, I think we can play it back through here. I've never played the video back through the GoPro, so we'll see here in just a sec. So let's get rid of this. I'm go ahead and hit record. Okay, now I got to put my helmet on. So I'm, I'm off camera for this. Oh, okay, so talked a little bit, rubbed the microphone with my finger. I think that should be enough to get a good test. So stop it. Power this puppy down. Oh, it has a check out your media option. I guess I probably should have hit that, but I want it's a little hard to maneuver with it plugged in. Alright, so let's uh, turn it back on. Let's see. I keep getting this notice because I'm using the old battery. See, it still functions with the old seven batteries. It's just not all the features are available. Um, so let's see, how do we go and watch our video? I've never watched the oh you know what? Maybe it'd be easier to do from the cell phone from the GoPro app. Maybe we can watch it on here and get an idea that everything's working correctly. Let's see. Oops, no, I don't want to do live. Oh, here we go. Library? Sure got it. I don't know what it was telling me, but put my glasses back on. Can't see. All right, so I think this is the video. I'll turn the volume up. Don't know if you can hear. I'm going to put my helmet on. I'm rubbing the microphone. All right. Okay. That definitely sounds like the audio is coming through the mic. So it appears that what I read online was correct. It was not. Turn this off. See, without reading the troubleshooting, I automatically was going to buy one of these. I thought the mic adapter had gone bad. But all the forums where people had the exact same problems I had where it worked fine and then just one day stopped working, it was the GoPro 7 itself. All I did was buy the new GoPro 8, we plugged in my old mic adapter, and it appears to be working fine. It's showing up now that, that there's an external mic hooked up in, in the settings in here, and it wasn't on the 7. Um, the real test will be going for a ride and seeing if um, you can hear me when I ride. That's what happened was I, I was going to edit some videos 
and there was no, you couldn't hear me. I mean, you could kind of hear me muffled in the background, but it was, you could tell, it was the external mic on the GoPro, or not the external, it was the internal mic that was recording because all you were hearing was the wind noise from the ride. So now what we got to do is figure out how this door comes off, which I don't want to break it. So I think on this on this one, this little door over here, you just kind of you just kind of open and pull, and then it just snapped off to get this door off here for the seven. Um, <clears throat> there's got to be a way. I'm assuming that this door comes off as well, and I'm sure it's it's something probably similar. Probably just open a certain way. I think I'm going to go to YouTube right now and find out and then I'll be right back and then we're going to pop it in our new case, our new frame. So I'll be back in a, in, in a jiffy. Alright, so it was really simple. You take the door and you just <laughs> tilt it back. It just goes right back on pretty easy. So you just open the door, keep pulling back and it pops right off. That simple. Alright, so here's our new frame. So I've already got the battery in there. It's the old 7 battery, but this just slides into the new frame like so. Now if you look, this has a little pad here that pushes to hold the battery in place. That just snaps closed like that, and now look, we've got access to the USB-C plug for our mic adapter. So we're going to plug the mic adapter through the bottom, squeeze that in there. So it's pretty snug fit, but that's good so it's not going to come out. And then once it's in there, the only thing different on this one is the adapter, the C port, the USB-C is horizontal. It was vertical on the 7. So maybe that will keep it in there a little better. This seems like there's less stress on this connector than, it, than there was when I had it in the 7. So that's it. So now we got it, the new GoPro 8, inside the, uh, the new case. Once again, this, or frame, I'm we'll calling it a case, but it's the Artman, and it's the V-Log case for GoPro 8. And said I think it was sixteen nine fifteen ninety nine or sixteen ninety nine on uh, Amazon. I'll put a link in the description down below. But uh, I don't know. This is I think for a filter. Whoops, this big circle thing. Um, I don't use any. Actually, it might be a good idea to get a filter. Not not really a filter, but just a clear one that's not really a filter uh, that would just protect your lens. So oh, that is something I forgot on the GoPro Seven. I forgot, I actually have a screen, uh, a lens protector on here, a glass, it's adhesive glass. So I probably want to order that for this, uh, something to protect the, uh, the camera lens. All right, um, well, that's it. I'll, uh, next video I'll post will be of me actually writing and recording the video with the new camera. Thanks, YouTube. Ride safe. Peace. All right, what's up, YouTube? Moto Mike 805 here. It's January uh, 30th, 2021, Saturday. Going on a quick test ride to test out the new GoPro 8. I uh, This is the second test ride because the one I went on just a minute ago had almost no audio. And then I plugged it back in just put my helmet on the house and it sounded great but I mean it the audio was so muffled a minute ago you could barely even hear the bike I think what I might have done was not had the connectors plugged in all the way it's kind of a pain to get this USB-C from the adapter into the GoPro I'm hoping that's all it was <laughs> if not I've got an intermittent issue with the adapter and not the GoPro 8 but testing it the, the day I got it, just in the house, it seemed to work fine. And then I went for a ride today and I had almost no audio. So we're just going to do a quick little jaunt down the freeway because I'm getting tired of doing rides and recording stuff and there's nothing to listen to. So I hope, I hope this works.
If not, I'm going to be ordering a new adapter. Oh, well, I'll have a new GoPro and a new adapter. We're just going to go up to the next exit and turn around. I'm also sporting my new fist wear, fist hand wear gloves. I got these to go with Bumblebee. Killer B fist. Uh, Million Dollar Bogan, one of the YouTube channels I watched, uh, a friend of his he's riding with had a fist wear uh, t-shirt on. So I looked them up. I don't know. I didn't do too much research on the company. I thought maybe they were an Australian company, but the gloves shipped out of Santee, California. I kind of like them. I don't know if I would want to go down at a very high speed wearing these because they feel pretty light. They do have some type of a protective material on the palm and the bottom of your fingers, but the back is super, super light. Um, but it'd be, it seems like a nice, it'd be a nice summer glove. They're also compatible with touchscreen devices, which is nice, so you can work your phone or uh, tablet or whatever. And they see they match Bumblebee perfectly. They even got a killer bee on it. I'm gonna be here forever, aren't I? Is this guy not gonna... Oh. It's like, nice of you to let me go, but there was lots of cars going straight. It's kind of hard to get out. This works. Let's say we're just doing a quick little uh, loopity loo here, trying them out. I'm hoping I have some audio when I get home. It would be nice to finally uh, start making some uh, videos again. Well, moment of truth here in a few moments. Ride like everyone's a hired assassin trying to kill you. Ride safe. <laughs> 